It is nearly 6 o'clock and the opening is about to begin, everybody. 23 artists. The facilities of this is it. Keo, be there or be square. <laughs> Tune in on Fear TV. Watch it like Matt. Come either from this way or up the stairs. The main entrance. These are the rooms in which you will find art exhibited inside. Greetings, citizens and medicines. Thing is about to start here. I am surrounded with artists. Surrounded with artists. We will find out if it's really worth moaning for. But this is a project where we're all come together from different points of origin, different points of departure artistically and geographically. And yeah, that's the result basically. <laughs> This evening's first piece that I'm beholding is Alice Wood. Monumental. This is some heavy duty weaving right here. A lot of work. What a huge piece, everybody. Am I supposed to go in here? Whoa. Look at this guy, look at this guy, he wants out, He's out of the womb with you. I'll just, uh, I'll just make you pass. Whoa. Some more textiles. This piece is kind of cool. I mean, so that's where Pablo Escobar left his coke bag. It's a major one. So what I just found out is that this is actually a lot piece. You can actually touch it. Did you see that? And I thought it was a sculpture. Well, it is. It's from paper, yeah? It's paper? Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, I'm inside. I'm inside. Feels great. I find myself inside of the womb. Proceeding out. Soon to be reborn. Outside world. Here I come. The dog is part of the work. Her work. You get to see this piece. You can actually take a picture with the dog. This is Alexander Yegos. Peace. So look what I found. This is a subtle, very subtle piece down the stairs by uh, Marietta Petelson. Entering the little white box. This is a ski mask. Finland set down in Norwegian. You can see a stalker there. It's like... Oh, a matchstick. <laughs> Where did you get this? Uh, I bought that on Etsy by the Marketa for like uh, 20 kroner for like, I think, two sets of earrings. And they're made out of this thing called jewel beetle wings. So this is actually a beetle. So this is actually a person actually moaning in the exhibition, moan. Yeah. 
In the little hallway from the cafeteria, a huge piece from the artist Lucia Glisterna Aragon. Hey. I'm inside the darkness. You gotta see this. The other building. Now we're approaching the black box, which is located in there. And later we're gonna check out Seiluken, which is located right there. 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 Alright, we're back, we're going to the uh, last chapter of this narrative today, and uh, we'll find out still if people are mourning. <laughs> Leaving the elevator, entering fourth floor. <laughs> Hi. So this is an interesting piece. We have uh, Annie Chen performing her art in front of us. <laughs> Aesthetically, these pictures are amazing. Another hidden room. So this particular piece here, you said that it's like an evolving piece. Yeah. Yeah, I, I feel like that there's some different structures. So yeah, Great. Oh. Great exhibition. What's your name? Eva. 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 Is the exhibition making you moan? Absolutely. Very much so. Eva really liked the sculptures, and she really liked the one uh, by the library. Yeah. With rubbers and uh, things attached to it. Yes. And the one... So Annie just finished one, and now she's starting with another one. Look at that. Where's the art? Where is the art? It was there. Uh, it was there and it was there. But does it exist? I'm confused, man. Does it exist? Is it now? Was it then? Where does it go? What I can say about the exhibition is that it's a great exhibition. I am exhausted. So much good art. So much good art out there. So the exhibition definitely made me moan. And... Uh, I will say the key word to this exhibition will be transcendental. Top